Hi, this is Dino Redwell from RackMedia.com In today's tutorial, I will be showing you how to change the coolant in your car Welcome back As we all know most cars use approximately 4 liters of coolant They feed the tank only holds about 1 liter The rest is in the radiator, engine block and all the radiator hoses So this is the uh, coolant tank which is located on the uh, right of the driver's side So first of all we need to drain uh, the coolant I have already done this so now we need to proceed to the next steps So first you need to have a filler You can manage to have a, a bottle like I did so just cut this bottle and use it in order not to spill uh, the coolant on the uh, engine which may cause you uh, some problems next we need to select your appropriate coolant liquid here I have selected the four seasons uh, coolant which is appropriate for all the different temperatures all year round great so let's open it Fill in slowly. Continue pouring the coolant until you see that it has remained in the coolant tank so what we need to do now is to uh, turn on the uh, engine and as you can see the water has uh, decreased so we need to fill in again until it remains in the tank as you can see the level in here www.rackmedia.com we turn on the engine again Next, we need to dismantle this tube. Just make sure that the air will get out of the uh, radiator and the coolant system in general. You can use a bottle as I'm doing in order to fill in the coolant which is going out. You can reuse it as it's still new. Wait until the this uh, tube stops from bleeding coolant when it stops means that uh, it is in the uh, correct level and there is no air in the coolant system let's close the coolant tank Be patient to wait until the tube finishing.
as you can see the coolant has stopped getting out of the tube so this means we have finished now we need to get it back to its place done make sure it is well fixed now we need to refill the coolant tank as we said before to the level appropriate level which is between the minimum and the maximum level so just add the coolant and check the level great as you can see the level is between minimum and maximum this is the recommended level let's close the coolant tank and our car now is ready to head into the road Hope this uh, tutorial have helped you fix your car. Have a safe trip. Peace. Thank you for watching. If you like this video, do consider sharing it. Click on the like button and go ahead and leave us a comment below. We'd love to hear from you. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel and the notifications. To get the latest tutorials that will inspire, empower and connect you. www.rackmedia.com Bye for now, see you next video.